Why are you dressed as Luke? You can just play. Why am I blowing up signage? Am I? What? 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 There's like a stream of water. What? I am under the water. Is it? <laughs> are you? And look, all the, none of the enemies are around outside. This is brilliant. What's going on? It's goofy. Unlike anything else in this game. Well, this game isn't particularly goofy. The music is just like. Like let's whimsical. Have... Whoa. The ball. Buster was that? I'm not sure they understand what water is. Ah! I mean, I'm not sure the people who made this game actually know what water is. It's that thing that floats in the middle of the sky, right? Whoa, look at that wave effect. Are, are we in like a Larry Niven ring world or something? I'm not I sure. I think we might be. Is this a sequel to Halo? Maybe. It came out like a decade before Halo, but actually, when did Halo come out? Uh, after this. Well, yeah, obviously. I guess it would have been like 2000 something. Fish monsters! Shark so monsters. All the games we played today had fish monsters in them. There you so go. it's a fish monster special. That's Welcome to Fish Week! Fighting just dolphin. like suicidal dolphin shark, dolphin alligators. I'm I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, okay, this is a strange, another strange thing. I don't quite. I I, I no. like I like the enemies that you fight for a while and then they just leave. At the same time, it doesn't give you a very strong sense of like you've accomplished anything. No. And I'm completely confused what the purpose of the water is or what whether there is water in this level. Yeah. That's water. It's supposed to be a water stage, they said. But you seem to be able to move in and out of the water stream without any consequences? I guess. Oh. Fade to black. Should you continue? Talk yeah, why not? We're going to do another ep episode. Uh, we're going to play more Phalanx. And, and since you, you couldn't have possibly guessed that, given that you probably clicked on this video intentionally or by accident. This is hey. the this is our Space Shooter Special Part 2. Just this game, though. Just Phalanx. Well, we because put... Dude, Darius Twin was kind of hard. This game is not kind of hard. Okay, don't. Don't shoot, shoot the signage, Blake. Didn't they teach you anything at hippie school? <laughs> don't shoot the signage. Um, you know that song? Um, uh, do this, don't do that. Can't you read the signs? Not really, no. But okay. Sign, sign. Get, 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 get the attack. Oh, it's on here. Yeah. Um. You vaguely, though you made it sound like a damn giant song. Sun, sun, everywhere with sun. Something, something, something. Don't, 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 don't just sit inside the spiky doom. Don't just drop. Let me run you! I didn't see it. There's <laughs> ah! <laughs> like a man standing holding a knife, like right in front of you, and you're like, oh hey guy, ow, I've been stabbed! To be fair, just because a guy stand there holding a knife, I wouldn't assume he was about to kill me. And also, you... See, this is just unfair. Also, stop just riding through walls! Listen, 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 just listen. Listen, listen. Are you listening? Yeah. Okay, listen. Excuse me a second, I just need to get some time. I got all my training from Kitty Pride. <laughs> stop throwing oranges at me! This does not count as a running joke! <laughs> you can't hurl oranges at people and say, running joke. <laughs> running joke. Well, I just proved you wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Demonstrably <laughs> false! My good sir, I believe I have shown you evidence to the contraire. You can't just stab people! Ow! No, no. I've proved myself correct <laughs> and you wrong once again. That'd be, that'd be great as like a character, like a, a purported hero, yeah. who just like like hit a factually psychic, accurate man. Who there's a psychic who keeps saying, factually accurate man. You can't just kidnap children and use them to build you castles. And then he like kidnap. oh can't I? I meant that in terms of ethics. 
This is slowly getting close, and it's kind of upsetting. Oh, there you go. He's going away now. Good, he's giving you your personal space. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of rude. The only thing that's really hard about this game is that there's the tiny, tiny, tiny bullets. Yeah. Tiny bullets. How many shots is I this just remembered, uh... Oh my god. There was like a reality TV show where the whole point was just to trying to annoy people and see how long they could last. So I figured out what the water does, and I'm sure you figured it out too, but you didn't tell me, you damn bat rat bastard. What? Just to tell the audience. It just makes you go slow. Yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> Sorry, I thought that was kind of soon. But I don't know what, it's not really much of a mechanic to base the level around. Oh, it's kind of interesting. Come on, get some pee. Alright, I'll grab the pee. The thing Bang. is, there's been so many shmups by the point when this game came out that they had to come up with something. So let's just have a tube of water. This actually reminds me of a Sign More, I think it's called. It's sort of a indie shooter game. Uh, but it's like my problem. I thought I got them super excited because I like shooter, like I like smups, um, and had like a lot of neat, like sort of steampunky yeah. plane designs and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's like so slow. Like they actually had to incorporate a fast forward mechanic for the cutscenes, just because everything moves at like at such incredibly low speeds. You see that? You see that that clutch move that I pulled off there? You got hit. Shut up. <laughs> I can't tell, in some cases, I can't tell what's backdrop and what's like. Yeah. Uh, things you can bump into. Here's a reference. That thing on the backdrop ah. there next to the angle could have gone up. No, oh. you can leave the bottle. I know, I didn't realize that was not backdrop object. No, it's a backdrop object. Well, thanks for that, Captain Now Helpful <laughs> Too Late. <laughs> I know, there are no official captains in the Navy <laughs> with that designation. Uh, Gary, put up all the evidence that Blake was wrong in saying that. Put up every single picture of Captain Guy that, that was helpful, but now it's too late. All of them. Not Lieutenant Commando! <laughs> he doesn't count. These bullets have an, un have an unfortunate kind of like, just... Oh, Lobster Boss! Lobster Man! I will defeat you, the tick! This enemy has approximately the same number of hits as a large Mega Man enemy. Yeah, basically. It's a huge, this large Mega Man enemies tend not to shoot harpoons at you. It must be like, uh, apart from the fact you have to create like tons of just ridiculous enemies, it must be kind of easy to make a shmup uh, graphically because you just have to make like a, like the ships don't have to be very well animated. No, they're basically static objects animation wise. I didn't like that enemy. He was scary. And he hurt my feelings. There's little yellow tags that keep appearing in the ceiling as background effects, and they look like power-ups, but I don't think they are. Also, the skipping the water effect looks a lot like something being electrocuted. It, it looks it looks like there's shock waves. Yeah. Or or sound wave! I don't remember what sound wave talks like. <laughs> Slightly more annoying than that. Is it Is sound supposed to be a bubble? Damn it. There's, there's a help one, yeah. We might have to redo this level, Blake. No, I'm gonna beat the boss with my zero lives and no power-ups. Yeah, good. yeah, we're gonna set it up <laughs> at some point. There's a lot of lobsters. <laughs> That's the thing this you is hear. like main. This must be the main enemy. Oh, bad joke. I mean, good joke. I don't know what the boss is gonna be. I hope it's something ridiculous. Uh, this game has not had very interesting monsters. Look, it's a weird dick. You know what it looks... You know what the enemies in this are? It's a weird dick with another dick on it. Whoa! And ah. a detachable penis in the back. Ah! There's, and there's eggs. So it's both sides of the reproductive system? Ah! This is an ah. This is definitely an, an ah type enemy. Like, ah! Ah! The bosses have, have been kind of multifaceted, but not very interesting in and of they, themselves. They have too much HP, I think. Each little bit. Yeah. I guess if you go there with like a lot of power-ups, they probably don't feel like that, but because we suck. Okay, so do I have to... This is a problem a lot of games have, and it's something you have to sort of deal with, because you want to be punished when you lose. Whoa! A lot blew up there. <laughs> I was expecting only one of those, like, a little bit of them to explode. But, um, a lot of games have, it's like, oh, hey, we want you to be punished when you lose. I know, when you die, you lose your power-ups. But that just means the worse, if you're not very good at the game, the game becomes harder. So the better you get at the game, the easier it becomes. Yeah. And that never seems right to me. That's why I, I that's why I like sort of grindy RPG mechanics, I feel. 
because it's not so much are you good, but I feel like are you willing to be patient? Well, and and there's and there's also like the, like it's more it's just all about either strategy, like it's all about choosing strategies. Yeah. And so you don't, if, and you don't really get punished for having a bad strategy. It's just like your gameplay is not optimal. Yeah. Or like it can be like you know if you're not very good at the game, then grind and you can get better. But like most games don't allow you to do that. I you beat the level. Beat I beat the level. With no power ups in one life. The, the, I, either this game is easy or I'm a god. Well, hyperspace! It's like a benign, Windows 95 screensaver. Hyperspace is like a Windows 95 screensaver brought to you by Windows 95. Oh, What's the diagnosis? DOS is going bye bye. Elective surgery. It's gonna be a blast! Yeah. Elective surgery. <laughs> Elective ele surgery. Div sur div surgery. Okay, I will. Can I give it a shot? Sure, go ahead. But I was acing that like uh, ace in my hole. Bye, okay. That's like my ace hole. Mm. This is enough. This game is almost really close to being oddly sexual, but not quite. Yeah, it's like take your phalanx into the bio cave. Actually, yeah. you know what? That's just sexual. <laughs> oh!